Welcome to my first edition of Amateurs Using Dangerous Power Tools. Here we are today, we're gonna to try to bullnose the edge of this travertine tile so that you don't cut your finger on the edge. I know this is a skill that all of you really need. So just in case you're doing a stone project and you wanna do a round over or any other little profile, we use one of these handy profiler wheels. It has like a little bearing right here so you don't cut too deep. And you just go along the edge and then you use a couple of different sizes sandpaper and let's see if we can do it right. I don't know. Amateurs using power tools. Now, one of my, actually my favorite ex-girlfriend told me, oh, you need to stop doing power tool stuff with all that, without equipment. So usually I'm a safety third kind of guy, but uh, I know she's gonna watch this. So here we go. This is called a grinder, an angle grinder. And uh, most people have one of these. It's really handy. So let's check it out. I don't have any electricity. <laughs> when all else fails, plug it in. Oh, great. See, I don't, I'm missing a glove. Okay, take two. <laughs> Gloves. Goggles. Grinder. Let's we'll try to stand off to the side so you can see it. All right, so now, I don't know if you can see this, but this is nice and smooth. And I just took the whole edge off there with like a little diamond blade. So let's check it out, see if you can get a little closer look. It's nice and smooth. And now I'm going to hit it with a sandy wheel. So this is a 50 and I've got 100, 200 and 400. So I'm going to fast forward while I'm fixing this. I'm going to just pull this off really quick. Much better if you have two grinders. And I do, but I was too lazy to set them up. One hundred. Two hundred. Four hundred. And these little blades, these little pads have little tiny bits of diamond in it. So girls, if you ask your boyfriend for diamond, make sure you're very specific. Boom. <laughs> Oops. Boom, and there we go. Nice, smooth bull nose. You guys can come check it out a little closer. See, it's really nice and smooth. It's like no lines, just takes it right off. And now I'm gonna do the edge of my whole swimming pool here. You can see I've got 125 feet of it to do. So if I don't, you're gonna scratch your little toes on the swimming pool edge. So until next time, this is amateurs doing crazy shit with power tools. Dangerous ones. Captain out.